This is Brian from Troy Built Models and I'd like to take a quick moment and show you everything that DJI offers with their Lightbridge system. We have already opened up the box and we have everything uh, lined up for you here. And we'll go ahead and start with the most important items. We have the Lightbridge ground unit, which will conveniently mount to your transmitter. And this is going to communicate with the DJI air unit, which is going to be installed onto your DJI 1000 Phantom or any other DJI product that you may have. With the ground unit, it is going to send and receive information using a um, very nice large antenna. The unit itself has a nice feature where you can check the battery by easily pushing the button and it'll give you an indication of how much battery is left. And if you press the button and then hold it down, you now have power to the ground unit. And again, for turning it off, you press it once and hold it down and it'll turn off the ground unit. On the bottom, we have a few ports here. One is for our charger, which is supplied with the Lightbridge system. The charger itself does come with a variety of different adapters, depending on which country you live in. Like all DJI products, there is a uh, micro USB port for updating firmware. We have our control plug-in as well, and we have a couple of options with that. We can plug in a single control so we can control the helicopter by itself, or if you want to take control of the helicopter and the gimbal simultaneously, we have the option to plug in the Y-split cable as well. It's very important to remember that the red is going to control the helicopter and the black will control the gimbal. Now these plugs don't plug directly into your transmitter. You actually will be plugging a training port plug onto these and this will plug directly into the transmitter which will control either the helicopter or the gimbal. As soon as this plugs into your transmitter, the transmitter has power on. The last two ports here are your video out ports. You have two options. We have a mini HDMI, which you can send out to any monitor or screen that you may have. And we also have a USB, which is designed to go out to your smartphone. And the Lightbridge system currently works on um, most Android devices. And here we have our air unit, which will be attached to the uh, S1000 itself or the uh, Phantom, depending on your system. With the air system, they give you all the wiring that you will need to properly install that onto your copter. The first that we have here is going to be supplying power to the air unit. And it's also our D-Bus system, which allows you to receive a, a telemetry back from the copter itself. The second wire that we have here is another D-Bus system that will actually be sending the control information from the Lightbridge air system to your A2 unit. There are a few ways that we can get our video feedback from the air unit. The first, we can plug directly into our gimbal control unit using an analog cord. We can also use the micro HDMI, which is designed for the GoPro. We can go straight from the um, mini, I'm sorry, micro HDMI directly to the camera and have HD, live HD coming directly from the camera. And our last wire that they supply with the air unit is the gimbal port. This is uh, made specifically to work with your Blackmagic gimbal or your GH4 gimbal and any future gimbals that DJ will be releasing. The ground unit speaks to the air unit through the antenna and the air unit has its own antenna as well. DJI supplies two types. We have the paddle antenna and if you buy the Lightbridge accessory kit you will receive a mounting bracket where the panel antenna will mount directly to your landing gear and will keep the gear or keep the antenna from uh, interfering with any of the uh, extra equipment that's on the helicopter. Also, we have more of a standard 2.4 antenna as well, which you can uh, mount directly onto the air unit 
you would only need two of these to give you one extra. And for any 2.4 antenna like this, the best reception is if one is directly 90 degrees out and the other is directly down, and that way you're going to get the best reception possible. So there you have the DJI Lightbridge system. Here at Droidbook Models, we're more than happy to assemble and put this system together for you. We uh, can also send the system to you if you'd like to uh, build and assemble your own. If you have any questions, feel free to uh, give us a call or shoot us an email. We are more than happy to help out.